Well, let's start with your word, enablers. The, we are completely dependent on the functioning of the internet for our economic and social future. It has to be an internet that's stable, that's open, is secure and safe, so we can conduct financial transactions in security on it. Now, these are all characteristics that are under threat at the moment. The openness of the internet is under threat from some countries that would like to make it their own private walled garden and fragment the internet. Cyber criminals are already making very large sums of uh, money from us by conducting crime at scale using the internet. We've seen the first signs of some states exploiting the internet to, for espionage and to some extent even for sabotage. And we will see cyber terrorism. We've had a little bit of that from the cyber army that's supporting President Assad, for example, in Syria, and that has been attacking some of our financial institutions. We're going to see more of that. The important thing to remember is that the internet is fundamentally insecure and can never be made properly secure. It was never designed to be secure but we're now completely dependent on it. So we've got to do the best we can, and that means people are going to have to learn how to be more safe online. Companies are going to have to secure their networks. Police services are going to have to start recruiting staff who really understand cybercrime to bring these criminals to justice. It's a big agenda, but it's very necessary.